Hey guys, DC here, and this is my first gameplay of Oceanhorn 2. This is on the Apple Arcade Knights of the Lost Realm. And now that I am playing this, I actually don't think I played the first official Oceanhorn platformer. I think uh, just o Oceanhorn Chronos Dungeon was the only one, other one that I played. At the end but we'll of the see world, how this goes. To be the last for realm of Arcadia. To end the world, I write this paragraph. To be the last for the realm of Arcadia. Before the fate set by Kronos. Oh, before the fate set by Kronos. Have run many times since these events were set in motion, and none who took part in the downfall of Arcadia was left unchanged. All right. An observer. At a time like this, your appearance is surely not... I'm thinking maybe this one goes... Maybe... In, I don't know if it's in canon, but this goes into the Kronos Dungeon. Sort of in the timeline. This is before. Maybe I'm wrong. To begin in a dark and stormy night, and all within a lost realm. And all within a lost realm. So we have a nice little opening, very theatrical, great looking game. Again, this is on the um playing this on the i on the Apple TV 4K second generation. So this really pushes the graphical boundaries of the uh, the system. He said he would meet us here. He said he would meet us here. Is it really you? Uh, is it really you? Mesmero, old friend. When I, message, I when I got the message, I could not believe it was from you. Holding a child. Look at that. He should not suffer because of my mistake. This child is for the show is for you to raise, Master Mayfair. Take good care of him. I think that's our hero, if I'm not mistaken. Ocean on Tomb, Knights of the Last Realm. Eighteen years later, so be like a teenager now. The baby would. Yeah, looks good. Very clean looking. Graphics sharp. Looks like it'd be like on the Wii or something like that. Easily. Yeah, I don't think any of this is rendered. It was all in game. Retrieve a lockbox. Retrieve a lockbox stolen from me many, many years ago by pirates. It could, its contents are vital for your knighthood. Good luck, Master Mayfair. Good luck. Okay, I should get a message Master here. Mayfair. And again, I have not played the first one. In progress saved. I'm using my Steel Series Nimbus, the old school one. Master of the Roll. I completed that. Yeah, I actually got a new Steel Series Nimbus as well, so I need to do like an unboxing for that. I may try to get that out. Maybe next week or something. Alright, A. Pick up and I can place. Yeah, so, so be on the lookout for that new Steel Series Nimbus. It's been out for a while. Exploring here. Now, obviously, this whole Chronos dungeon, or not dungeon, but this whole Chronos sort of universe, at least this platform version of it, definitely gives you the Legend of Zelda vibes. I feel like, you know, he's. This, this main character is very Link ish. Based off of Link or inspired by Link. And, um, really, you know, has a lot of, has been influenced heavily from, by, or by, 
the Ocarina of Time. Okay, this thing's kind of tough. I have to, I have to get, kind of get my, my battle mechanics in place. Alright. But this, you know, definitely, uh... I, I can see Ocarina of Time at the foundation of this, and, and many, many platformers, uh, this one, platformers like this. But yeah, I need to get my uh, battle mechanics up here. But yeah, look at that, it looks great. I destroy those pots, looks good. Pretty game. Let's see that. They did a good job on this. This is definitely, you know, I can definitely see myself uh, on a console. This on a console. Just trying to get my. My bearings here with the controller and everything like that. So look at that when I hit that bag. Falls off. Hey Jones, you were right, this place is completely abandoned. What on Gaia happened here? And then just uh his hideout. Into the tunnels or something. Okay, here we go. Old pirate hideout, crater's edge, archipelago. Archipelago. Got different creatures moving around here. Find Master Mayfair's package in the pirate's hideout. Okay. New challenge revealed. Fire walk with me. You can climb up on objects under the height of your shoulders. statue. Looks like an owl. We can search over here. Don't know what that was. Oh. What that was, that grew underneath me. I knocked out two of my hearts. It's strong. 
Okay, game progress saves. Cactus. Damn, dude, the things in this game are strong. Like from from the get from right from the beginning. Look at this. What's this? Lower the gate. Okay, I can use my shield to push this boulder. Broken gate ahead. Let's see about this, do I need a key? I need to find a key to old pirate hideout. The blue button stays pressed on its own, okay, so I don't have to worry about getting... Okay, it's a shield. Can use it to push obstacles, lost treasure found. Oh yes, he's donning the shield now. I see it on his arm. His left arm. Okay, so I can push this now. far there. So we'll have to jump across this thing. Oh, there we go with a flip, the front flip, look at that. Alright, we need some hearts. Okay, yeah, we're back. Get some hearts back. Cactus really did a number on me. Throw various objects you can carry and throw. The red button does not stay pressed down on its own. Okay, so blues do, reds don't. So let me put something on here. A barrel or something like that. Okay, oops, I stepped on it. Oh, so when I get off of it, it goes up. I have to make sure I put this on here correctly. Alright. The battle strategy is really strong with these things. They're offensive and defensive. Critical hit. Go. One more in here. Strategy coming back, Ocarina of Time. That's cool. He shivers his sword. Alright, got the key. Alright, I can go back to the other door now. Ready to go. Oh, I'm 
messing around here. But yeah, definitely appreciate the pacing of this game, kind of throws you in it. Unlike like a, what is it, like Baldo? Basically, that was kind of weird in the beginning. All right, we're in the old part hideout. Let's see if I can push this down. Is it gonna kill some people? Please do. Oh yes, it did. Did crush more. Crush more. Yeah. And the boulder. Crush them all. Much easier. Oh, I'm up at Cadet. 25 coins. Health refilled. Oh, I can search over here. See what we got. Oh, just harp. Was it herbs or harp? Fell there. Weird angle to jump at. Alright. Not much up here. I don't want to take any fall damage. Oh, okay. What else we got over here? Keep the barrels away from the torches, they can catch fire easily. So, they can catch fire. I think I know. What we, what we have to do here Materials excess will transform into a heal spell units you can use in battle. Oh, okay. So yeah, all those hearts that I've been collecting, they can, they can turn to a spell. Okay, card game. You can't win if you don't play. You know, that's what I'm about. Challenge people that I meet. Okay, we'll play that a little bit later. But, um, yeah. So, yeah, that's a reason to get excess health heal spells. Good to know. I like that the game did that because yeah, there's so many hearts. Captain's key. So many excess hearts you'll, you'll collect, and then you start doing something with that, so it's innovative. So you don't feel like you're just wasting. It's just, it's just out of waste collecting the hearts when you're full. Okay, treasure room. Okay, I think I got the key. Only with Captain's permission. Let's see. The 
This is giving me like Goonies type. Oh, all right. I probably should have slashed up some of those bushes, but it's all good. Oh, what's that? Okay, so like a little octopus looking arm, maybe. Oh, yep. Yeah. Cephalopod of the Ancients, the Lactose. Galactos. Isn't he? I don't know. Let's see. Galactus. I think that's from the Marvel Universe. But Galactus is big and purple in the Tarot card game, and you need to find a person to challenge. <laughs> that's random. Why did that just come up? Did I click on that? <laughs> I can't challenge Galactos. Alright, what's going on now? Uh -oh, he's throwing stuff at me. Can I open this? I need to find a key. Key to the captain's chest. Alright, so I think I have to actually fight this guy now. He's throwing pots at me. Oh man, yeah, he's everywhere. His arms are okay. Going through this shit now. Come on, guys. All right. So how do I get? I have to get a hit on this guy. All right. All right. I think he's up. He's maybe exposed. There's a heart here too. Look at that. Taking damage here? Oh. He's just following me when I run, he comes up. Oh, his arms take damage? Oh, there we go. <laughs> Look at this. His arms. Okay, I think he's okay. He's throwing again. Cut scene for that. No, oh, that hit me. I don't know if I took damage on that. Oh, critical. Alright, so he lost one of his arms. What's um, another one? Alright, so what's going on here? Oh, this guy's exposed now. Oh, he looks crazy. Look at this. Okay, yeah, so he's really throwing now. So close, no, what is that? What blew up? Oh man, look at this. They robbed me. Oh wow. Go back and do this again. Crazy, what blew up? I don't understand. What was that that just blew up? That's annoying. I 
I was running from him. Crazy. I don't know what blew up like that. Just a random explosion. Is what to take him out. It's so annoying. Oh, what blew up like that? See, he hasn't even thrown any pots yet, and now he's gonna throw pots. I got him. That was, that was, he should have died that first time. It was crazy. Alright, so I think that's... Alright, I got the key. I think that's probably as far as I want to go. I get the key to the captain's chest. Alright, so... This is Ocean Horn 2. Check this out, this this game was really smooth, you just saw me battle one of the bosses here. I found, okay, the Master Maker is lockbox, okay, so I think I got everything I need now out of the stage. Oh yeah, they're just pulling me out. So it's time to go, they're saying, pretty much. Hopefully you enjoyed this uh, quick little uh, gameplay. Uh, if you did, be sure to like, comment, subscribe. And as always, you can't win if you don't play. Thank you.